it? What is this thing? So, I figured the locked door would pique your curiosity. What is this place, Prince? As I told you, it is the Celestia. I could elaborate, but I don't... Do not play games with me, Prince. You unearthed it from the mountain. You're not entirely wrong, hi. Oh, but... Mercenaries! It's...
Hello, welcome back. So I wanted to play this without saying anything because it's a very stressful fight. You have to focus 100%. I mean, it's not such a hard fight. You have to understand the basics. So first of all, you have to, at the beginning of the round, you look very, very carefully on them because sometimes you will miss the lightning strikes, and that might kill one of your units. Also, it's a lot of RNG. Sometimes a lot of people come from the left. Sometimes a lot of people come from the right. Sometimes a lot of people come from the north. And the worst one is when they come from behind you, because if you get a few archers behind you or from some other ones, I don't know. I think it's a little too much RNG for my taste, but you'll have to restart the fight sometimes if RNG doesn't go your way. Because look at this, this was perfect. These people couldn't do anything, these people didn't even arrive at the fight in time. And here it's just another recruit, so this was the one of the best case scenarios and the lightning strikes didn't attack the Celestium. Sometimes they will hit Dexera or the other guy that is supposed to help you. So Dexera will be on the right or on the left and the other guy will be on the right or on the left. So put them on the flank so they can cover you more or less. And then just use your archer and your ranger to DPS this really console. Well, my swordsman is a DPS as well. <laughs> but yeah, it was quite a painful challenge. I mean, it's not as hard as the other stuff I've done in the game. Definitely easier than the Creeper King, but definitely requires a lot more patience and sometimes you have to get your party composition right. So I finished this just because I was so I had super powerful uh, super powerful mercenaries. Over buffed I would say. So this is only a level 8. Who oh, is medium armor? Probably weak, medium armor. Yeah, I don't even get the good armor for that. I guess I can use it. 
have their armors already lined up. <laughs> you fought bravely, mercenaries. By destroying this relic, you saved a county from the madness of its prince. Maybe even the five kingdoms. Now I'm very curious how, how this would be played if you help the scholars. If you help the scholars, probably you have to defend it for a few turns. I don't know, maybe if you help the scholars, you'll be in the defense mission and you have to defend them from the Inquisition for a few rounds, and that might be easier, a lot easier, but... Even so, the hardest part is knowing that you have to go into the castle, kill all of the scholars, and then attack it and occupy the, the relics. I mean, we actually got a little bit ahead of the difficulty curve. Oh, he's shaking and he has armor. What okay. happened in Drumback was a warning sent by the God of Light. One must stay away from the relics of a civilization that left only tombs behind. As yeah, for your true. reward, I realize it is far from what you deserve. But no matter how many crowns we could shower you with, it would never come close to rewarding you properly. We will make an example of Prince Errol's heresy. He will be taken to the holy city at the heart of Edoran, where he will face. I want to know more about this ancient relic and the other stuff we did over here, but I guess we have seen enough for one day. I think it only unleashed the we eye, so not close. control it. So I don't think you can control it. We will it. make an example of Prince Errol's heresy. Uh, let me show you my the weapon and their armors. I don't know. If you have a lot more people, this probably is more is easier. I'm curious how the other side of the defense mission is. Well, I guess I'll never find out because I'll never replay the entire game again to get to this point. <laughs> Definitely. The harder version. I cannot imagine how the other option would have been, but definitely this was the harder option. I don't want to exit, I want to stay here, it's so nice. Dead or alive. I did have a wanted level of 3 for 7 days. And that's how I level my climbing chaos. Until they caught me and I had to pay my dues. I guess that's it, there are only bodies all left over here and we can leave. We could buy a cruel place. Gosh, this could be our base or home base. I, I mean, it, was, it would be a lot of travel time, but I would gladly do the travel time just to have this place as my base. Maybe even repair the Celestium. Okay, that was the hard part of the mission, right? So, this is 100% done. Unfortunately, I'm not sure what locations we haven't discovered. Or what are our 8 remaining location completion? I completed the curse village. I guess we still have to do the rat nests and head the Inquisition back, which I'm not sure how it's done. Some areas are a lot harder to 100%. I mean, look at Tiltran Country. I still have two things to do, and I know I have to. I know I have to get a mission to destroy the Bandit Lair, but the Bandit Lair is not spawned yet. And I have. I, yeah, I have to spawn the Bandit Lair, and then I have to destroy the Rat Infestation over here in Artes. Till the Rat Nests, which are the main thing I have to do. I also have to do the legendary creature, which is the new quest that spawns. So, some quest you might get from other regions. Of course, you still have to do the arena. We haven't done the arena, but the arena is terrifying at this level for me. Okay, let's do a little battle over here and then we'll go over there. Ah, fighting bandits, so nice. 
we only have two valor points. Doesn't matter. It's an easy fight. Our group is so powerful at this moment. I think I made the right choices most of the times, like giving the the heavy guy the fever, fever oil. A waste to shoot at that guy. Run. These are quite tough for uh, this type of challenge. Easy FPS, easy. Don't go crazy on me. I can also just we can blow him. Yeah, I made a little mistake, doesn't really matter. Yeah, let's wrap this fight and then I'll end the video. I, I cannot do anything else. I need a break from one of these. Such a cool mission. I got very upset in the other video where I was trying to do it because it's RNG. The lightning strikes are a big part of the mechanic of that fight and they are super annoying. Sometimes they hit the right spot, sometimes they uh, go way off course. Poison, fire, everything. I don't like the way he's looking at my ranger. And I was right. I guess I can just engage him and then run away. Run away behind my <laughs> swordsman. Yeah, the swordsman is a little too powerful with this setup. I don't know. He's just a good uh, DPS as the archer or the ranger. You will regret doing that. Now I just have to stabilize, yeah. It's still the game on the difficulty. The game on this is still pretty rough, and that's why I don't play Iron Man in this game. Never play Iron Man, in my opinion. Because we are going to, I don't know, beat Planch and play a normal battle like this. We shouldn't be any problems, but then suddenly, you might find yourself that your archer and some of your, uh, your archer, or usually your ranger, gets into a lot of trouble. So I like to do it like this. Let's engage. And then get another point. I guess if you, you can sort of farm the arches for uh, points like this. Yeah, but it's not really fun, is it? <laughs> He hit so many times and with a poison, yeah, poison is definitely the way to go with him. Wakey wakey, time to attack. <coughs> eagle eye, what is eagle eye? Precision increased by 10%, that's a nice one. I guess it was a big risk anyway. <coughs> Okay, we have done it. And this is kind of like the demonstration of how my party... Come on, you get better armor, you get the same armor from the random fight. And when it's exactly the same armor, you get the, the same armor from a random fight that you would get from the glorious end game battle, which is supposed to be the final battle of the game. 
Oh well, yes we shouldn't. Okay, see you next time. Bye bye.